¿Qué onda, raza de YouTube? Makes a connection back with another snack review. I'm your host, DJ Entertainment for Less. And I'll give you my opinion on these papitas, aka chips. As you can see, I have all seven flavors of Takis, corn snacks in my collection. All the bags are four ounce, 113.4 grams each, except for the new barbecue picante. The one over there, it's 9.9 ounce, 280 grams. The, the small bags cost about a dollar and change, about a dollar 29 at my local corner store. You can probably get these at any Mexican market. Uh, they should have these at the store, so go to your Mexican market and uh, they'll have these takis there. These are made in Mexico by Barcel, a company of Grupo Bimbo. Then they are imported and distributed in the U.S. by Barcel USA, which is, a, which is headquartered out of Capo, Texas. All the bags are fresh and have a freshness date until the end of November, some even until December. All these corn snacks are rolled up like mini tortillas, tacos, and crispy and crunchy like a deep fried flauta. You can eat them straight up or you could use them for dipping in salsas or cheese or bean dip, or just throw them in your mouth and savor the flavor of each one. I organize them from my least favorite to my favorite to the best one I like. And I'm gonna start off with the first flavor that I like the least. If you wanna pan in over here, this is the Takis Barbecue Picante, barbecue sauce flavor. Uh, Takis, that's the big bag, that's the only one that I have at the big bag. Uh, that's a Takis Barbecue Picante, that's a barbecue sauce flavor. That one has no heat, it's a slight lime aftertaste, it has a smoky wood flavor and a smell, but not much of a traditional barbecue taste like your other brand of uh, American brand barbecue chips. I give that one a five out of 10 in total. Okay, you wanna pan into the next flavor, the Takis guacamole. It's a guacamole avocado flavored chip. There's no heat, no lime. It has a guacamole taste, but nothing compared to dipping your chip in a real guacamole. Has light onion seasoning. Not so good of an aftertaste. I gave these a five out of 10. On the next flavor <clears throat> is a Takis Crunchy Fajita. Taco flavor, no heat, no lime. It tastes like you're sucking on a beef rib seasoned with Fiesta brand fajita seasoning, but not as strong or good as a real thing. Not much of a fajita or taco smell. No aftertaste. And I give these a five out of 10. Okay, on the next flavor, Takis Salsa Brava, hot sauce flavor. No heat, no lime. It has a very strong hot sauce smell. You can taste the tomato seasoning and the flavor. These, I give a seven out of 10. So these are something I would buy again. Okay, on the next flavor, Takis Nitro. This is a habanero and lime flavor. Very strong tingly lime taste. Has medium heat, strong pungent dry chili smell, and it has a slight afterburn. These I give a seven out of 10, I will buy again. Okay, down to the next ones. These are the Takis Special Edition, extra hot, hot chili pepper and lime flavored. Similar, these are similar to the nitro ones with the strong lime and chili flavor. They're the hottest out of all the flavors and heat, but still they're about a medium heat with a little afterburn taste. These I give an eight out of 10. These I will definitely buy again. And now to the Takis Fuego. These are my favorite ones, and I believe these are probably the ones that sell the most. If you're gonna go out and buy Takis, I recommend this flavor to start off with. It's uh, the Takis Fuego Hot Chili Pepper and Lime Flavor. This is a perfect blend, a very balanced lime with chili flavor. The lime doesn't overpower the taste like the nitro ones do. It's a light heat, no afterburn. It's a best overall flavor out of all of them. These I give a 10 out of a 10. As you know, my raking system, I rake them one through 10. One, two, and three I won't buy or eat again. Four, five, six, I'll eat, but I won't buy. So if someone offered me some, I'll eat them, but I won't buy them. Seven, eight, nine, or 10, I'll buy again, 
and I'll eat again. And like I said, these, I give a solid 10 out of 10. There's my review of all of the seven flavors that I know of. You want to pan back? Those are all the seven flavors that I know of. Probably the first video reviewing all flavors on YouTube. Like I said, my favorite flavor is the Fuego. So if you're going to pick one, I'd, I recommend that one. DJ Entertainment for less. I want to give a shout out to the newest MC member, John Robles out of San Antonio, Texas. Shout out to you, bro. You're a beast shotgunner. So the newest member of the MC. If you like this video, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Share this with your friends on your Facebook, your Twitter. Stay tuned. I'm going to be doing an update showing you my collection of Jaritos Mexican sodas. Stay tuned for that video. I'm going to show you all the flavors of these I have in my collection. Ya sabes, more Mexican snack and drink reviews to come. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, mi raza. Cortale.